Hey, Professor Gosser here with Art and Design at Cedarville University. I'd love to show you the Carnegie Center for Visual Arts. As you may notice, you're looking around and um, we are not on campus. We are slightly down the street from the main campus and this is an old Carnegie Library. It was built in 1907 and was given to the city of Cedarville. At one point, the city gives it back to the university and it has housed, I believe, everything from uh, uh, music. I think engineering was here for a little bit. And now it's mostly our 2D design classes. So I'm going to show you a painting studio and a drawing studio. There's a 2D design studio downstairs and uh, advanced studio spaces for painting students. So let's go in. I think there's some classes in session. So we'll poke around, see what's going on. OK, come on. So next door, that was Professor Caleb Booth. That was a drawing foundations class. Looked pretty cool. Um, that is a, uh, a class you would take your very first semester here as an art and design student. Uh, drawing is kind of the foundation of everything we do. And you're also getting a sense of this building, these floor to ceiling windows, lots of light. Um, we are now in the painting studio. So this is a, a first semester painting foundations course. This is the most, um, for most of the students in here, this is the first time they've picked up a brush and uh, got into oil paint. Um, it's a lot of fun. Um, the professor is excellent, uh, I've heard. It's me. <laughs> uh, I love painting. Uh, lots of light in here. This is a southern exposure. Northern light comes in on the other end of the building. Um, it's totally uh, rehabbed. Uh, uh, we've, there, when, I, when I came in uh, as a new faculty member, this building um, had a drop ceiling in it, and uh, we've since uh, gone back and took that out, revealed the transoms. Uh, I love the architectural detail in here. Plus, you're going to notice like the floor, uh, this, this old Carnegie Library, no one uh, really minds much if we get paint on the floor. It's very organic. I think being off campus allows for more creativity as well. So now I want to take us downstairs and I'll show you the 2D design lab and then we'll poke next door and look at some of the advanced studio. So here we are in the 2D Design Lab. Um, this is also one of the foundation courses for art and design students. You would take your freshman year. Um, it complements a course called Introduction to Art, which is a lot of terminology, uh, looking at art, talking about uh, composition techniques. And in this course, you actually get to make things based on that content. So this is a studio course. Um, and um, for, for a lot of people, this is the first time they've had to consider issues of, of composition and 2D design. So it's a lot of fun. Um, it's usually a lot messier than this and lived in. So you're here at the beginning of the semester. And by the end of the semester, there's going to be 
paint and paper scraps and lots of blood, sweat, and tears in here. Um, I'm gonna go next door now and show you some of the advanced studio spaces, talking about lived-in. That's basically a house uh, for some of our uh, advanced painters. So, come on. Hello. 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 Uh, this is the advanced painting uh, studio space. Uh, advanced painting um, um, moves in, and uh, we have like uh, coffee makers and hot pots and uh, chairs and Christmas lights. Uh, they, they really take ownership of this space and that's good because they spend uh, a lot of time down here in a given semester. Uh, because our advanced courses might, be, um, might provide a theme in portfolio building for studio art students, this is a repeatable course. So um, like this student has been here uh, for the last year, maybe a year and a half now. Um, so she's... she's uh, uh, very, very comfortable. Um, and because there's some students working, you can check out their work. Say hi, Laura. Hi. Um, studio art student? Senior. Senior studio art student. Um, recommend studio art? Yes. Yes? Um, why, why was it a good fit for you? Mm. And it steered away from more the technological side of design and art and more towards tradition um, and mediums that have been used for years and years. Going forward, what do you want to make of art? What do you want to do with it? Um, I want to do illustration, yeah. illustrate design, possibly for art companies. Uh -huh. Okay. We'll see. It's we'll very see. specific. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Love where that's going. And we'll say hi to Emily. <laughs> okay, good. Hey, uh, that's Carnegie. It's mostly 2D uh, design studio spaces. Um, it complements uh, Alfred Annex, which is mostly 3D.